we are at Attridge Ville today uh, at uh, two schools, the secondary school, Mongani Technical Secondary, and this uh, Walton uh, Jensen School. Uh, we are coming here to present a donation that is coming from our friends, our 11, 10 embassies that has given us food. Uh, these schools definitely they are not the one that uh, they've got feeding skin, but because of the social economic problem of the area, then the teachers felt that they must just amass some donation of food so that the kids can eat. Because other kids are coming from the scholar camp, other kids are coming from 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 where there are no parents and there's nobody, so now they needed to have food. They are pantal for the government is not supporting them, but they felt that they need also to ask food. And now uh, our 10 uh, embassies who are stationed here in, in Pretoria, they have donated food for both schools. They will share the food and we want ready to appreciate that. I'm here to hand over on behalf of the 10 embassies that have donated this food. Uh, we really appreciate the visit by the Deputy Minister in terms of handing over a token of appreciation that was given by the 11 different embassies. There is food, sanitizers, and so forth. We really like that cooperation, and we believe that from here going forward, we'll be able to do more with the uh, Department of International Relations and Cooperation. Mm. This is the first time we get a donation of this kind, and we really appreciate it. It's going to be of use to the learners. At the technical school, uh, we discovered that children are producing lots of things because out of their learning, but those things are lying there, and they are useful equipment that they have produced. So I have advised the school that they must just do something, partner with any shop around town so that they can advertise uh, these products and they can sell those products and the money will come back and feed the kids. So I think it will be better. In this primary school, this is the oldest primary school, it's almost 80 years. It's an 80 year school. I'm told by the principal that they were supposed to celebrate the 80th anniversary of the school last year, but they couldn't really have resources. So if ever anyone have resources, even in 2021, even before the end of this year, the principal is open, you can accept it, you can come and celebrate the, the 80th anniversary because this primary school was the first primary school in this area of Etrashville. So many leaders who are in the society now, they have been purchased by this primary school.